Hi, I'm Sandy from wormsandstuff.com and today I want to show you how to harvest the bottom tray of your Worm Factory 360. This is a Worm Factory 360. The bottom tray has been on there for quite a few months and I feel like I'm ready to harvest it. So first I take off the lid. I'm going to put the top tray on top of the lid. This has only dry shredded paper in it to keep down any possible fruit flies. The next tray down is the tray that I've been feeding in. As you can see, it has quite a number of worms in it. The second tray down is compost that's almost finished and there's still a number of worms in it. And then the bottom tray that's ready for harvesting is right here. The problem that I have with the Worm Factory 360 is no matter how long I let this bottom tray sit, it always seems to have some worms in it. Um, you can see the bits of plastic that do not biodegrade and some pieces of credit card that should probably not be in there. But when I'm ready to harvest it, what I do is I have an empty plastic container that I only use for castings. And I'm actually going to put it all in here and then as time goes by I'm going to keep picking the worms out The castings look really good, but there are a lot of worms. This is why I prefer to use a flow-through kind of system instead of the stacking bins, because the stacking bins, it just seems like no matter how long they set, there's always going to be some worms left over in them. So after you empty out this entire bottom tray, you'll have an empty tray that you can give a rinse to. Um, the other thing you want to do is probably clean out the compost from the very bottom of the worm factory. You can see there's not a lot of liquid in here and there really shouldn't be. If you're getting a lot of liquid in this bottom part, you are simply having a worm farm that's, that's too wet and that's when you're prone to getting fruit flies or having smells. Stuck to the bottom tray is the worm ladder. So pull your worm ladder off. Scrape your finished composting into that top tray again. This worm ladder is the thing that helps your worms make it back up into the bottom tray. And then when you put them back on, the tray that used to be the second tray down is now the bottom tray. This is the tray that will can use a little bit more food being fed in. And then I'll put on my tray with the, the dry paper, put on my lid, and you're done harvesting your Worm Factory 360. Thanks for watching. Visit us at, at wormsandstuff.com.